Hey guys, it's Zenith Dark Sky with another reaction video here, and today we're finally getting around to watching um, Ken, or as the other name that he goes by from SB19, shout out to 18, uh, Philippe, um, I assume is how you'd pronounce that, um, performing the song Palayo. Uh, live on the Wish Bus. Now, this has been requested a few times. I'm getting to it a little later than everyone else. I know, I know. Either way, though, um, before we get into this, though, you guys know I already am a huge fan of this song, so hearing this live is just gonna be a treat for me, basically. But, before we get into this, if you guys would, hit that subscribe button. Um, we're on our way to 10,000. We're trying to get through this 5,000. It's been taking us a little bit to get through 5,000, so... Um, please do hit that subscribe button, help me out there, and, uh, yeah, let's get into this. I just like, I just like that. Wish 107.5 I just want to say real quick, right there, the the intro where he's just kind of um, singing, but like super low right there and just kind of almost like talk singing, you know, um, I love that. Also, I want you guys to know my wife is a huge, huge fan of this song. Um, I, I showed her this song not long after I reacted to it. And ever since then, she's just been in love with the song. She has this on her playlist, like her, her like, you know, playlist that she listens to, like, every day. Um, so she's a big fan, too. Anyways, let's get back to it. Wish 107.5 Did I come to play with you? Oh, I used to know what I was going to do I still can't even get a boom, oh if there's a problem, girl, that's you. Oh, what a good couple of new hours. Can you see how much I'm dancing? Yeah, the coat and I'm gusto. Cool and bubble sign. Okay, I just want to stop there and say, um, not this voice, but when he's like actually singing, like, um, not in this deeper voice, but you, you know what I mean. The, the kind of more upper, like, mid range kind of, um, it's still pretty deep, but you know, it's a little bit higher than this. Uh, that voice, I think, I think it, his like the rasp and stuff that he has is perfect for music like this, like R and B esque, um, kind of trap, um, just dirty rap, nice R and B music. Like, um, it's just, uh, I don't know, it's a perfect sound for that kind of music, like. Um, I know a lot of the lyrics to this song are in um, Tagalog or, or, or some dialect of Tagalog. <clears throat> but um, it's just uh, even like I could I could easily like it doesn't take much imagination for me to imagine hearing uh, this song in English on um, on English radio stations and stuff. It's very, very good. I uh, I love his voice on this song. That voice. Also, I want to point out that um, there's kind of layered vocals and stuff going on here. Like, there's a vocal track, and he's singing over it to layer the vocals and give that effect. Very good. Um, for those of you that don't know with music production or just music in general, low sounds travel worse than high sounds. Like, if I do something high pitch at one volume um, and then low pitch at the same volume you're still going to hear the high pitch thing better than the low pitch thing. It's just how sound travels. So, when you have a low pitch singer or, you know, someone doing this kind of low quiet thing like this right here, you really, it really helps to layer the vocals so that you have two of those sounds so that it amplifies that a little bit better. So that's kind of 
that's probably besides the fact that the layered vocals just sound nice and he can harmonize with them it also is probably to boost the sound and make it a little bit more hearable you know audible Story guy, so good. Beautiful. Transition. Also, I want to point out um, some of my uh, some of my people that maybe aren't into um, what's the best way to put this or into males or into dudes. Um, that is very much one of those things that I've heard. I've heard a lot of people like I've heard my wife say that she thinks my like sleepy voice is sexy and stuff. You know, um, that, that is a, like the sound that he's doing, like the, uh, like thing, but he, like the, it's, he's throwing it into his voice, um, when he sings there. Um, so I can only imagine he did that for sex appeal, right? Cause he's a beautiful dude and I'm sure plenty of, plenty of people were into him. Um, and I can only assume he does that just to, just to amp up the sex appeal even more, but I, it's still something to point out. Because a lot of times us dudes don't know, you know, like really why people are into the certain things we do or this or that. And um, I, I know I've had that explained to me several times by several people that apparently the sleepy voice is, uh, is you know, attractive, right? So the, the uh, like, is, is, it's heavy in that, you know. I just wanted to point that it's nothing, it's nothing analytical about the music, but it's just, you know, it's something worth pointing out that that's might be a reason why he does that there. If somebody is like, why does he kind of do that? Like raspy kind of thing. That's probably why, but I don't know. Just a guess. Woo. Falsetto is nice. beautiful i love it dude i love that song i love that song especially when you know what the lyrics are saying and everything i remember reacting to that and just being like oh 
<laughs> the whole time, dude. He just he tells it like it is right there, man. It's a, I love that song. Um, I, I love the performance, though. Uh, it's a it's a pretty good performance and a lot of smart things. You know, had layered vocals and you know wasn't singing with the vocal track here and there and stuff. It's just really a lot of smart things and a lot of smart singing like placement, I guess, in the song where. You know, that way it just saves your voice and, and it's easier to do the um, harder things in the song if you're not having to worry about hitting every word and doing all of this and that. So awesome. I love it. I love the performance. Hit that like button if you like the video and you like the reaction. Be sure to comment down below if you have any suggestions or opinions on the performance or anything like that. Uh, share it around so your friends can throw their thoughts, comments, and suggestions down there as well. And be sure to uh, hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Over 69% of you guys still are not subscribed. So please do hit that sub button for me. Help me hit 10K. I'll see you guys in the next video. And thank you.